Hello everyone, welcome back to another edition of Remake the Look. This is where we take an inspirational photograph using thrifted pieces to recreate our own individual look. Here are the three looks we will be recreating today, so let's get started. The first model is wearing this camouflage print top. She has the collar popped as well as the sleeves cuffed at the end. And the front of the shirt uh, appears to have this asymmetrical panel or uh, lapel that hangs all the way down to uh, a little bit past her knees. She's also wearing these wide leg pants with pleats in the front. It looks like it has a high waistband and the pants are uh, cuffed at the ends. I decided to recreate the look by also wearing a camouflage top that I did a DIY on. It was just a regular print shirt. I cut the ends diagonally and uh, made it appear to be the same exact look as the model. Instead of tie, uh, leaving the ends loose, I decided to tie them in a knot and wear them that way. I also have a pair of wide leg pants. It also has pleats in the front and pockets on each side. I think I recreated that look very well. The next look we see, the model is wearing this Chanel-like or a styled blazer. It has fringes on the collar and the bottom of the sleeves as well as the lapels. She's wearing these distressed denim light wash jeans, rolled and cuffed at the ends. It looks like underneath the blazer she's wearing a white shirt looks like a silk or linen and she's pairing it with the white pumps and the little um, white bag i decided to recreate the look by wearing this chanelica like ja jacket that i had in my closet i decided to go with a darker wash of jeans and instead of a high collar i have a round collar with uh, pearl accessories and the pin or the accessories being the pearls and the brooch. I'm wearing a white tank underneath. I'm cuffing up dark denim jeans and wearing them with these Oxfords, these gold tone Oxfords to match with the gold jewelry accessories that I have. The model isn't wearing a belt, but I decided to add one just to complete my look. And um, I think that was pretty cool as well as far as accessorizing to compensate for the high collars and so forth on the model's look and make it my own personal look. And that is what it's all about, guys, making it your own individual look. But of course, you can replicate it as the model is wearing. Okay, guys, I really enjoyed this look. I wanted to do something different very casual but chic at the same time this model is wearing a long tailed button down shirt with pinstripes in it she has the sleeves rolled up denim distressed cut off jeans with the uh, rough edges and everything and she's wearing a high black boot on top of the blouse she's wearing this black bandeau over on the top I just think this was a very chic boho look and I replicated the look or I recreated the look I love to say recreated instead of replicate I recreated the look by wearing this Balmain which I thrifted was lucky to find at the Goodwill outlet Pierre Balmain men's button down rolled up each sleeves and I have a pair of cut off jeans that I did a DIY myself it has the fringe in it that uh, the rough edges rather I'm wearing them with a pair of um, knee-high black boots similar to what the model is wearing so that is it guys so if you are interested in any of the styles and you just can't seem to find uh, pieces like that when you're thrifting I recommend that you go on um, YouTube, uh, social media, and there's plenty of DIYs showing you how to distress your jeans. Going on to Pinterest, you can get so many inspirational ideas when you're thrifting those pieces and putting those outfits together. So until then guys, 
thanks for watching and i hope you are living fashionably ever after because you know what it is always easy to style and look good even on a budget take care guys